Hello, today I'm going to show you how to type a basic business letter using Microsoft Word. First, open up Microsoft Word. This is, off, this is Microsoft Word 2007. Here, uh, you want to familiarize yourself with several of the tabs that are located in the screen. Home, which has a lot of your font information and changing. Insert, where you can insert pictures, text boxes, some word art. Page layout, your margins, orientation, size, and columns. And the only other tab you really need to be concerned with is the view tab where you can uh, change your view, select ruler, and, and, and the such. The review tab does go over a couple of things like spelling and thesaurus if you do need that, which is quite handy. Click back to the home tab. First thing we're going to do is type our address in the top left so make sure your cursor is in the far left the top row I held the shift key and hit enter and that allowed me to go directly below without skipping a line comma after the city and then I'm going to hit enter twice now I'm going to type in my recipient's address. Comma, after the city. You can type the full state or abbreviate it. Just making up a zip code. You can type the phone number here too. Again, made up phone number. Enter twice more. Now you're going to type your salutation, comma. And I've already copied something from a previous letter, so I'm just going to paste that in there. Now what you're going to do is if you notice all of the paragraphs start, they are left aligned, and there's one space in between, one line in between each paragraph. It's recommended that each paragraph be three, um, two to three sentences long minimum. Now you notice the font is different here, so we want to make sure all the font is the same. So I'm just going to highlight everything, select the font I want to use. You want to make sure to choose a readable one. I'll select the Mandra font. And I recommend a, a size of at least 11 to 12. In our case, we might want to make it 12 to 14 because it's a smaller font. Typically no larger than 12 unless the font is extremely small. Now after the letter is done, I'm going to hit enter. Enter again. I'm going to tab over until I'm at the 3 right here on the ruler. Type in your auto auto correct on the spelling. Type in your closing, and I left a space so I can leave room to officially sign it. And again, you want to type your name as well. And there you have it. We did forget the date. I apologize. We have to add the date just right up top. Today's date right in between your address and the recipient's address. Today is May and you see that the date automatically comes up. Press enter and the date is added for you and you want to make sure you save. Press the button in the top left. Save. For our case at school, we want to make sure that you are on your H drive. Select your H drive and 
I already have a computer literacy folder, so just want to select that and make sure you type business letter and your name. And then you can click save. And that's how to type a business letter. I'll be having more tutorials as we go out through the year. If you have any requests, please let me know.